another episode which does not feature an industrial spur but rather something very odd about a railroad so this is the track that is next to the bar tracks as you can see it goes all the way over here it used to connect with these tracks here it connects a little more down there but what is this i mean why why here and there were some buildings here this is actually an apartment building name i mean of all places you build an apartment in the middle of two active railroads you're gonna have a lot of people that are not happy about that let's take a look at the street view it's some kind of something i don't know exactly what this is like a granary a refill station what what is this obviously you can see it's abandoned okay but it was used like until around 2011. here's the tracks you can see they go through some shrubs or one of the tracks goes down there Let's take a look at older dates, like 2007. You can see clearly there is some kind of lumber car there. I'm not sure what this is because, well, yeah, I'm just not sure. More train cars over there. More train cars over there. Um, let's take a look at the 2011 image. More train cars. I have no idea what this is. It's really weird. Also, there appears to be some kind of trailer park there, which is even weirder. Like... Welcome to the USG Fremont Reload Center. What? What is this? What in the world is this place? Um, yeah, it's really weird that they would just build an apartment right here because I, I don't... I mean, sure, I'm a train enthusiast, so obviously I would love to live by the tracks, but other people, not so much. Just a bunch of train cars. Like, I'm not sh exactly sure what what was that building. There's another building nearby that also had a similar thing um let me see if i can find it let's see it would be right here it looks like they tore it down too but if you look on shin street which i know a rail fanner has been filming here lately um you, the tracks went into this building as well so i'm not sure what's going on i'm not sure what it is there you can see the tracks it's like a giant warehouse it looks kind of eerie to me Doors open. Actually, that door's open too. A little spooky. But it doesn't scare me. It's just spooky looking. So, yeah, that's my find for today. A very. Oh, there's a bus museum right there in case you weren't. In case, yeah, bus museum. But what. What is this place? I mean, like. What is it? I. I have no idea. Let me take a look over here real quick. Oh, that's nice. A little train bridge. Very low clearance there. So yeah, a very, very weird area. Used to be some kind of warehouse of some kind. Um, with the track that used to join the other line, but now it doesn't. Oh, and here's the track that connects both of them together right here. Just a railroad triangle.